Garbage is so depressing. Garbage is great. There you go again. <laughs> you got the weirdest reactions. I'm not trying to be weird. No? It's just that people judge things by what they are, not by what they mean. Huh. You can identify a person by his garbage. <laughs> take this. No, take this. <laughs> Okay, this is a man of taste, but limited income, an intellectual, athletic, but very absent-minded. Go on. An excellent, but inexpensive selection. Little known in this country, but prizes a table wine in France. Mm, has a nice nose. Good year, too. New York Times crossword puzzle, all filled in. Even the foreign words. Listen, where does it say he's athletic, hmm? I give you a sneaker. Worn for very serious use. Why absent-minded? There's only one. Means he's either misplaced the other or mistakenly thrown it away or... Or maybe he only has one leg. Excellent. <laughs> Good work. You're learning. <laughs> I don't understand you, David. You wanted that prize so much. Why didn't you? I changed my mind. I'm erratic, okay? Yeah, but... But you won. I mean, you won a genuine Humphrey Bogart. I got the guitar. Yeah. I came in second in this New Jersey contest. I got a trip to Fort Lauderdale. It's the only thing I haven't won. Do you think... Do you think it's something lacking in your character? When you never win anything. I went out with this man once. There was nothing special. He was a dentist from Minneapolis. Nothing happened between us. I mean, Joey was away in Miami Beach. And... Well, he said, <laughs> he said that he could tell everything about a person just by looking at their fingers. There's something about you that misses, he said. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but you miss. He was staring at my right thumb. Oh, I still think about that even to this day. How could a dentist from Minneapolis say that I miss? A few empties, burnt out birthday candle, and the price tag Joy left on my coat. Can't tell much from my garbage, huh? Just that the dance is over. Can I come up? Please? Mm-mm. 